All right, true or false, you need a full set of gym equipment to get a full body workout in. I'll let you think about it. The answer is false, and we're going to prove it to you guys that all you need is a couple of dumbbells or maybe a bar to get a full body workout in. Take a look. I am here at Turning Point Gym with my trainer, Alex Gard, and today we're doing something that's pretty simple. You only need mm -hmm. one tool. What are we working on? So what we're doing today is called a bar complex. Okay. Okay, so all you need is a bar. Depending on how strong you are, depending okay. on how many reps you're doing, you can put weight on the bar. But normally we have clients do it with just a bar all by itself. Normally, as in for me, because I'm very weak. All right, now what body part is this going to work? So the nice thing about the gar bar complex is that it's a little bit of cardio. It's going to okay. get your heart rate up. But it's also going to be working every muscle group in your body. Okay. Because what we're doing is we're starting holding the body, holding the bar in the front part of your body. Okay. And then we're moving the bar up and on the back of your body. So you're going to start with legs, back, shoulders. We're getting everything, everything in. Getting everything in. Today. Okay, now this is also an exercise that you can do at home if you have dumbbells. Mm -hmm, they just switch exactly. out the dumbbells for the bars. I yeah, think. it's the same exact thing. Okay. Just using dumbbells, have a dumbbell in each hand, going through the same motions. Great. Okay, yeah. well, let's get into it. So the first thing we're doing is a straight legged deadlift. All right. So keeping that back straight, pushing your hips and your glutes away from you. Good. Keeping that back straight. So you're activating those hamstrings, a little bit of your glutes. The thing with a straight legged deadlift is that everyone goes. Everyone's kind of different depending on their flexibility. Some people can go all the way to the ground. Not Some people flexible. can just go halfway down their knees, just kind of depending on how you do. Okay. okay. So then the next thing. So next, we're going into a barbell row. Okay. So keeping that back straight, keep those elbows tight to your body, and you're rolling that barbell straight back. Think about rolling it to like your belly button. And the same thing, keeping that bar close to your body. Okay. Good. Perfect. So now okay. we're going to do a barbell press. Okay. So same thing. Make sure your hands are even. There we go, good. So now we changed all that momentum and now we're working your shoulders. Good, and now you're gonna put it on your back. Good, so first get situated, get your squatting stance. Okay. And now we're gonna do 10 squats with the bar on your back. So now we're going back to legs. Now we're gonna do a little more quads. So same, same thing, pushing those hips back. You wanna stay on those heels. So okay. now we're doing lunges. So you're going to get in a stationary lunge position. You're going to be right here. And it's going to come down right next to that ground and then back up. Okay. okay. And you're going to do all 10 reps on that one leg. Good. Perfect. Keep everything tight. Keep that core tight. And don't wobble. Whoa, that is Good. no fun at all. OK. So the workout is just one part of losing weight and getting the body you need right. Mm -hmm. You also exactly. need Nutrition, so luckily we have Noaimi here to give us a rundown of her menu. Hi, I'm Noaimi with Eat Fit, and a few items for my menu this week are bacon wrapped pork loin with roasted sweet potatoes and asparagus, and I have a breakfast casserole with sweet potatoes, parsnips, homemade pork sausage, organic eggs, baked and cut to perfection. If you'd like more information on my menu, please check out my website at eatfitabq.com. All right, so that is a wrap on our workout today at Turning Point. But if you guys want a recap of what we did here, we will have it at Casa.com.